Well, you mentioned Sweeting Estates. Did you not support the, and then the Sweeting Estates, the idea behind that was to bring in some higher incomes into the district? I would say no and yes. I'm going to answer the question in two parts. I say no because bringing higher income should have been done from indigenous people there, not from outside. A lot of the people who live in that area are not native relatives to the land. Sweden Estates should have been developed. That was one of the... Mrs. Sweden in the 1930s spent many years and many dollars concerned about the people. Mm -hmm. He was a man concerned about the, the convalescence of, of a community and money he made. So it wasn't about the money for him, it was about the caring of people. And I think that to sacrifice what he had there and not replace it because the money that we should have been given under CRA and under uh, these block grants should have been for revitalization. Mm -hmm. It was, should have been to rebuild what's there and to preserve what was there as a part of community. Same thing with my gym. Same thing with uh, Dr. Shirley and the, and, the, and the medical center. We need to preserve what is there. It has vital history to the city of Fort Lauderdale. All right.